GE Appliance manufactures more than just products at their facility. They're also keen on building those strong community partnerships. They recently worked on a project with Mother's Milk Bank Northeast. Joining us here in the Great Day Live studio to tell us more about it, this is analyst Katie Klenda and Ann Lindbergh, Digital Technology and Program Manager. Ladies, thanks for joining us here today. Thanks for having us. You all do so much. <laughs> like I'm always like amazed. I'm like, wow, they do that too. I mean, talk a little bit about like the community partnerships and how this specific one came about. Absolutely. Yeah, so we do a lot in the community. We have our big Blue Wave event this Friday. Yes, do. I'll be there. I can't Yay. wait. Yeah. Awesome. I'll be at one of those uh, locations. This, this is a really unique project yeah. we did last year. So our, the leader of our digital technology department was at a conference and met the CEO of Mother's Milk Bank Northeast and learned about that they had purchased the Salesforce platform for their nonprofit, uh -huh. but they didn't know how to implement it. And they were really struggling. We can help you with we that. We can help. <laughs> I yeah. do. We had done a lot of Salesforce implementations at GE Appliances, and we have a great digital technology team that has the Salesforce expertise mm -hmm. and experience. So we thought this would be a really unique project yeah. where we could get a team to do it for them. Okay, and so for people that may not be familiar, what is a Mother's Milk Bank? So Mother's Milk Bank is an amazing organization that takes donated breast milk and processes it and mm -hmm. gets it safe and ready to be able to donate it to medically fragile infants in the NICU who require the donated oh, breast milk. Wonderful. Yeah, it's amazing. Wonderful. So how did you go about like recruiting the team of volunteers to put this together? Yeah, so I was really excited when I learned about the opportunity and being a mother of three and I had a medically fragile little girl, so I know firsthand how yeah. important this organization mm -hmm. is. Um, so I first reached out to the women across our digital technology organization across the globe um, and asked for volunteers, told them a little bit about the scope of the project mm -hmm. and just received an overwhelming response. Response. So many mothers and women across the group just wanted to participate. Right, and that's a personal thing too that mm -hmm. you're asking them to do. Were you yeah. all surprised by how many women from the team um, volunteered? Yeah, yeah, we were. I mean, um, across the globe, India, yeah. you know, across the U.S. Mm -hmm. and, and not just moms. We forget that. We think, right. oh, you're just here in Louisville. And then we think right. globally, you yeah, guys exactly. are everywhere. And to have that level of support is huge. Yeah, it was. You oh, want to talk wonderful. a little bit about the team? Yeah, what yeah. was the team like? Kind of who were they made up of? So they were all women within our digital technology organization. Um, there was nine of us from across um, across the globe, as she said, US, India, and um, we had volunteers from each side. And then we also have partnered with Salesforce. They had a volunteer that helped us out as well oh, wow. uh, that was able to work directly with Mother's Milk Bank. How is this volunteer project different from the other projects that you all work on? Yeah, so other projects we usually do, you know, landscaping, we'll do yeah. like day of projects where you're going and rebuilding a, a building or something, but um, this one was more of a long-term project. We were able to use our skills that we use in our day-to-day, -day, you know, developing Salesforce, and yeah. we were able to use that to create some infrastructure they can use. Um, for as they continue their business just to Isn't grow. Isn't that the neatest type of like give back that you realize your talent or your gift is helping somebody get their word out? I don't know, there's just something exactly. very different about that that feeling of of the give back. And I mean, that's kind of inherent to what you all do, mm -hmm. right? That mm -hmm. kind of the culture is about, like you mentioned, going and rebuilding schools and, and churches and, and what you do yes. around the group. Like, did that attract you all to GE in the first place? Did you know that they care so much about you volunteering in some way? Absolutely, yeah. and I've been with GE th 30 years and been part of the Volunteer Council and so many Blue Wave projects over the years, and it's just, it's such a part of our culture and it's so critical. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like you said, to feel like your gift, your craft, your skill mm -hmm. helped all that. How did that? It's, how did that make you feel? It's useful in so many yeah. different ways. It was like I do this in my day to day, but yet it's also super helpful for this this milk bank that yeah. mm -hmm. that they they don't have the tools to do this, but they can come to a corporate like us and we can help them. It's huge. How and then just kind of the impact deeper than mm -hmm. that. How it's going to transform the lives of families. Yeah, absolutely. Right. You can see in the video, it, it's a lot to process the milk. And they've, um, through implementing this tracking system we put in place, they've been able to greatly improve the productivity and process more donated milk and get it to more infants uh, quicker. So mm -hmm. it's been uh, a great um, win for them, wow. and they're excited about it. Love mm -hmm. that. Well, thank you all so much for coming in. I can't wait to Good. see what's going to happen at Blue Wave on Friday. Very excited about it. Thank you again. Thank you. Uh, you want to learn more about GE Appliances, just head on over to geappliancesco.com.